What's good, Alabama Nation? Alabama family, how y'all doing? This your boy Chin, and you rocking with the Bama Dynasty. Lego, Alabama family, we are back with another practice video. Look, I just want to congratulate Alabama with the Dubski we got at home. Congratulations, y'all boys. But this week, we got to focus on another team. That's Texas. Yes, I said it. Texas. The same Texas we beat by one point last year, they back. And I think they may have a chip on their shoulder. Let's dust it off for them. Y'all boys, keep your heads in the game. Be poised, but with more tenacity. Y'all know that's my favorite word, tenacity. Play with that tenacity, my man. Look. Congratulations on the Dub versus Middle Tennessee. There's some things that I liked, a lot of things that I liked, but there's a few things that I may think we need to touch upon just so we can be a perfect team. We're going to start off with my boy McKinstry, who played an amazing game. I want to say the whole secondary played an amazing game. But we're going to play Texas, and they're going to be a little stout, a little harder to get with. But there ain't nothing that we can't handle. That's the thing about it. We're elite. We may have two cornerbacks, and I say may because I don't know the update, that may not be playing. So if that is the case, next man up. You know how we play around here. Next man up. I want to focus on the linebackers. They played an amazing game themselves too. My boy Blackshear got a I don't know, fumble pick, whatever it was. And my boy Lawson got a sack. Played great. This boy right here, number 30, he coming back. Best believe he coming back. Do not sleep on them boys. Linebackers play great. Now our receivers, let me tell you this. They played a well-fit game. But like I said, we can get better, y'all. You know we got a standard. I know it's pretty high. The legends of our past class, they set the bar high. But, hey, it's a standard that y'all got to play by. Just get better. Defensive line played a great game, too. What I don't like is I didn't see them sack numbers up there. Defense, inside, outside line, I didn't see it up there. But with Texas, they had a couple, I want to say eight tackles for loss. We can get that. We can exploit that and take over the game. Get to the quarterback. Sack, tackle for loss, fumbles, all that. You already heard me the last couple weeks. We need all that. Offensive linemen, y'all played a good game too. I don't know if it was the running backs that couldn't hit the hole well, but I like the protection that y'all have for Milro. Maybe one or two sacks y'all gave up, but I mean, it's going to be like that. It shouldn't be like that, but I'm going to give y'all the benefit of the doubt for this game. Next game, none of that. Do not let the quarterback get touched at all. But like I said, we're playing Texas this week. Y'all boys, keep your head on a swivel. Play like this is the first game. Play like this is the last game. Whatever it is to make y'all believe that y'all just need to bring everything out of y'all to get the job done. Because like I said, Texas ain't sweet, and we didn't let Texas know we ain't here to play. I know he's playing football, but we are not here to play. No games. Defensive line, get to the quarterback. Get the sack. Get the tackle for loss. Cornerbacks, keep the receivers at bay. So the defense linemen and outside linebacks can get the sack. And if the ball does get up in the air, get the pick, locate the ball, block it, whatever you need to do. Linebackers, keep your head on the swivel for run plays and pass plays. Don't get caught up on the play action. Be where you need to be and get the play done. Ready for signal calling and all that. Other than that, y'all played an amazing game. Let's get ready for Texas. Let's thrash them, boys. Let, let, let's thrash them, boys. Let's let the whole NCAA football community know that we are here to stay and we ain't going nowhere. Okay? Other than that, holla at your boy. Like, subscribe, and we out. Lego!